From the campus studios of Saarland University, this is Ropecast, the lighthearted podcast for learners of English, with Roger Charlton and Peter Tisha. Hello, Peter. Hello, Roger, and hello, all you Ropecast fans out there. Fans? Yeah, that reminds me, Peter. What? We were going to talk about sports. Okay, what sports? Well, let's start with football. You mean soccer? All right, if you want to call it that. Well, it is called. Well, in the U.S., this is soccer. Football is something completely different from, from well, the, the game played with your feet. But uh, in 2008, yeah, football means the European Championships. Ah, okay. But the uh, I'm pretty sure the Americans not even heard the slightest, you know, inkling of that in their news. So, what about the position of football in the United States? Is that the national game? Well, it's one of the national games, actually. The Americans would have more than one. They would have, on the one hand, football, which is, as you know, the game where you have this not round ball, which everybody, or which each team tries to carry into the other team's end zone and throw it there, not kick it. And so, the, the players are all kind of dressed in medieval armor? Except that it's not made of metal, this armor. It's made of plastic. Except maybe the helmets may have a little bit of metal in that. I'm not really familiar with that. But yeah, they have to be protected. Um, they play these things all year round? No, they don't. They play that basically in the winter time. So fall to almost spring, the Super Bowl, which is the final game. And uh, other than that, they play baseball. Yeah. And that's the summer game. And, of course, another winter game is hockey. Hockey? You mean played on a field? No, 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 no. That's field hockey. Hockey is hockey. That's ice hockey. Oh, right. So it's played, you know, with, with this little black thing called a puck, and it's played on ice. Yeah. Why don't they play field hockey? It's a game for sissies, actually, for Americans. If no! You, yeah, it's a game for sissies. You I'd better... have to explain that. A sissy is, is like a boy who is not very courageous. That's a sissy. You better not say that in England, for example. Uh, well, okay, granted. But this is this is a way, the way Americans would react. It's a game for for girls. Yeah, oh. it's played in a skirt. And But <laughs> the, the game for real men, that is something. That is, uh, is ice hockey. Hockey. And what do you think real men in Britain play? I guess soccer. Yes. Although, you know, the Americans would not call that a real game. <laughs> or rugby? <laughs> rugby, yeah, I guess rugby. That is that is sort of football without rules, right? <laughs> oh, no. Let's not get into that one. <laughs> uh, well, I never got that anyway. And this, this thing of passing backwards all the time, I mean, it doesn't make any sense. Give me a break here. And I guarantee you don't get cricket. No, <laughs> definitely <laughs> not. That's sort of like baseball. When you have an hour to spare, Peter, I'll begin to explain the rules of cricket to you. Okay, so one of our next podcasts, now take note of this, folks, will last for about an hour in which Roger will explain to me and to us, if he can, the rules of cricket. And or after that, I'll get back at him and explain the baseball rules. He's only kidding. Bye for now. Bye. You've been listening to Ropecast, brought to you by Saarland University, featuring Roger Charlton and Peter Tischer. Tune in for the next edifying episode on your podcast dial. <laughs>